Hello and welcome to History Pod. On the 15th of July 1975, the two rockets of the Apollo Soyuz test project launched from the USA and the USSR in the first international collaborative space mission. The American Soviet detente that slowly emerged from the Cuban Missile Crisis had seen tensions between the two adversaries begin to thaw. By 1970, political negotiations had given way to technical cooperation and engineer exchanges between the two space agencies. Nevertheless, the two nations were highly critical of the other's space technology. While the US was disapproving of the Soyuz reliance on automated components that could halt an entire mission if one failed, the USSR criticised the extremely complex and dangerous Apollo technology that relied on highly trained astronauts and introduced the risk of human error. By 1975, preparations for the Apollo-Soyuz test project, known as the ASTP, were complete. The crews had spent time learning the other's language and had been granted unprecedented access to both the American Apollo Command and Service Module and the Soviet Soyuz 7K TM spacecraft. At 8.20am Eastern on the 15th of July, two cosmonauts lifted off from the Cosmodrome in Kazakhstan. Seven and a half hours later, the three-man Apollo crew followed from NASA's Kennedy Space Center. Two days later, on the 17th of July, the two vehicles successfully docked and the hatches were opened, allowing the two crews to greet each other and conduct scientific experiments. The two spacecraft separated after 44 hours and returned safely to Earth, concluding the first ever international collaborative space mission. 